Hi, welcome back to another edition of The La Forest Show, where we get to the root of it. Today, I'd like to share with you a few tips on Nolai relaxers versus sodium hydroxide relaxers. Yes, they both relax the hair, but which one is better? The calcium hydroxide, which is no lie, to me is really a lie. It should not be on the shelves for us to use, but somehow the FDA allows it to be on the shelf and we put it on our hair, mainly African-American women, a woman with hair of a very severe curly texture. We put it on our hair and it's ruining our hair. Don't buy it, people. I'm telling you, don't buy it. When water comes in contact, with the Nolai relaxer, which is calcium hydroxide, it tends to reactivate. And every time it reactivates, it's depositing like a crystallized buildup on your hair. Then the hair becomes dull and it tends to break. Now, if you're not using a clarifying shampoo to take away that buildup, you're going to be in trouble. The best thing to do is to go to your stylist, or if you are very experienced in hair care, get a regular lye relaxer. Now you say, what's the difference in the sodium hydroxide, which is the regular relaxer? I notice all these different strengths. You've got the mild, the regular, and the super. The difference are buffers. Turn the bottle over and look at it. Some have more olive oil in it. Some have shea in it. There are different things that you can put in it yourself to buffer it. So I don't buy mild and super. I'll get the regular because I work pretty fast when applying the relaxer. But if you're a person that works pretty slow, get the mild, add a little bit of olive oil to it, and that slows it way down. Or if you work fast, but you want your client's hair to have more of a conditioning, softening shine to it, get the regular and add some olive oil in it. Don't buy that super because the super strength has very, very little buffers in it and it will go right to your skin and burn you. You don't want that. So hear me, do not buy no lie relaxers. It is unhealthy for your hair. Thank you for listening. And remember, attitudes are contagious. What kind are you spreading?